Hey everybody, I'm your host, the man sitting in the middle, Ernie Johnson, with Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny Smith. Boy, what a treat. The NBA postseason begins. We'll watch the visiting squad as they go up against the home team. Taking a look at this home squad, the second seed in the East, a confident team entering these playoffs. They're looking to make a deep run and contend for a title. And tipping off the series tonight, Kenny, when you're entering a game one, what are you trying to establish? You're just trying to get into the mind of your opponent. You're trying to get in that space, be aggressive, and take care of the basketball. Because once you get in their mind, you never leave. What am I thinking right now? What am I get into my mind? What get am I thinking mind? right? What am I thinking right now? You're like, what is Shaq gonna say next? No. What? Thinking about a two in there. Oh. Yeah, that would be good. Okay. Shaq, what you got? Well, if things don't go your way up front, don't get discouraged. Be willing to make adjustments if something isn't working. You got in my mind in the 94, 95 finals when yeah, you swept us. Yes. You know how we got in his mind? You know what I heard? Mm -hmm. Those are the birds that I heard uh -huh. inside his mind. You know what I'm thinking right now? Toast with the tuna milk. Grilled. Grilled bread. On the oh, grilled tuna toast. Milk. Same thing. Yeah. Panini. Shadamas knows man, all. You are. No, he's Especially good. when it comes to food. Oh, oh he's goodness. in your mind, Ernie. Oh, man. Give me that tuna milk. welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Game 1. 2K Sports presents the playoffs of the NBA. Kevin Harlan here with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg, and our sideline reporter is David Aldridge. It'll be the visiting team and the home team. You look at the home team. Because they're the second seed, they'll have home court advantage through the next two rounds. And this is the payoff for the work you put in during the regular season, getting to play this deciding game in your own building. And these fans, I'm telling you, are ready to carry them. Man, and how fortunate are we to be a part of something like this? I mean, come on, this is playoff drama at its highest level. The way these two teams have battled, it just felt all along like this series was destined to go the distance. chance here to set the floor courtesy of Gatorade all fueled up and ready to go for this one they've got Autobio Grant is out there with Allen and it's Webster in at the small forward position now here's Dudley good and so it begins taking control right up front and you know Greg that's what you like to see grabbing hold of the lead right now right away Here's Antetokounmpo. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. And Antetokounmpo is, is just fearless. I mean, hit him, knock him around. Really doesn't phase him. Doesn't matter. I mean, this guy is determined to get the job done. And he does. And he's got his first chance at the line here. One shot.
Free throw, no good for Antetokounmpo. You know, what you really like about Antetokounmpo is he wants to keep getting better. I'd say he's accomplished that and then some. Yeah, I love the communication and the chemistry between those teammates. Ross with it, and Allen picks him up defensively. Out to the right wing. And just about a minute into the first quarter. Here's Bagley. Rebounded by Dudley. Has to be disappointing seeing him miss that one, Kevin. I mean, the defense wasn't bad, but still, I think he needs to convert from there. And the basket by Webster. And, and guys, this is what you like to see early on, gaining a little confidence from range. Yeah, and you know it, Greg. Oftentimes, you get that first one to drop, and your confidence rises like yeast. It's good to get into a rhythm at the start of the game, no doubt. So first quarter just over a minute and a half in. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. Arvin Bagley picks one up. second free throw. Ross with it. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. And there it is for him. And he can time his passes so perfectly. Wow, what an assist. Gotten their first three shots to go in for him to start off this game. Now one against Ross. The baseline J. Allen shot is off. And on our sideline, our reporter, David Alden. Well, I was able to talk with Mike D'Antoni for just a minute. He wants to win his second game of the season against this team. And the key, he said, is about limiting drives and penetration. He added, we can't allow them to play to their strengths, finishing around the rim. So it's important for us to own the paint. We'll see who wins that battle, Kevin. Back to you. Okay, David, thanks. Ross with a wide open look. Gets an open look and hits. And that's up-tempo basketball at its best. So much easier to operate the open court when a steal triggers the break. Shot from 12. Allen, that's good. An almost perfect start to this game. Four for five. They're rolling. And in this first quarter, about three minutes played. Out of the combo, kicks to Ross. On target from 13 feet. And what a special player. Antetokounmpo is sharing the sugar there. The vision he showed. Nice shot finding the open man. Dudley the pass to Autobio. Grant outside. 14 feet away. Tries again. That's tipped. Just over three and a half minutes gone here in the first. Ross, that's good. Great ball movement there. Gone four of seven from the field, shooting over 50%. Now here's Dudley. Defense right on him. Allen finds Dudley. The pass to Webster. Here's out of Bayern. That's in, and he found his range with that one. Now one for two. And that's his strong suit, the ability to find his way through the D and finish at the rim. Ross passes to Frank. Tipped away. Allen outside. And the dunk by Grant. Chemistry at its best. An unreal alley-oop. Yeah, you're right. The pass, the catch, the dunk. All of it perfect. And it all had to be, Kevin, because that's not nearly as easy as they made it appear. Outside, out of the combo. 
Back to Ross. To the paint. Here's Frank. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. First trip to the line for him here. Gentlemen, two shots. Blue shots. And he knocks down the first one. So he hits both. Gone six of nine, shooting it well. One fifty eight left to play in the first quarter. Williamson, the pass to Parker. Gets to the rim for two with the D all over him. Parker's got his first two points of the night. And they are going toe-to-toe -to -toe here tonight, guys. This, this thing's like a heavyweight fight. Yeah, these teams evenly match, Greg, trading hits and refusing to give up any advantage. Pass to Slater. Tries a three. Offensive rebound. Frank off with the layup. That's not the type of opportunity he fails to convert very often. We've got 108 left to play here in the first. Makes it off the glass. Just no resistance on the inside. That's their fifth consecutive make in the paint. And Greg, those looks they're allowing are almost automatic. Knocks it loose. Herder covered by Parker. Bagley with the bucket. Got to push Bagley out of the paint. Once he's close to the rim, he is locked in on spawn. Passes it to Parker. Bagley with the rebound. That's smothering defense. Chicken and gravy defense. Not giving him an inch there. That's how you guard the inside. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. There's 21 seconds left in the first quarter. Eklund. Covered by Parker. Eklund. Oh, that's blocked. Here's Williamson. And that shot was up in time, but doesn't go in. A good close contest so far as we finish the first quarter. The away team leading by just one. The second quarter coming up right after this break, so don't go anywhere. And pronouncing Giannis Antetokounmpo's name correctly has been a challenge for many. Something he discussed before today's game. The worst I've ever heard was my rookie year. A guy called me Antetokounmpo. And Kunupi in Greek means uh, mosquitoes. So he basically said uh, anti-mosquito. And the mosquito, definitely not a good comparison for Giannis. Yeah, more 
sound like a condor, you know, but that last name certainly has a lot of people looking for nicknames. And we welcome you back to our presentation of Game 1. And looking at what we've seen so far, guys, from the visiting team, what do you think? Getting high percentage looks, wearing down that defense on the inside. Grinding away down low, man. Just filing them down. Love the bully ball method. Paying off well. We've got Parker, and it's Henry in a shooting guard. Guys, seven times the lead has changed hands here now. Yeah, and that number should easily top double figures before it's over. Here is Perkins. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. There's the dish to Bagley. And we're about a minute into the second quarter of play. Here's Williamson. Pass to Park. He kicks to him. Six to shoot. The shot. Set it up with the fake, but it's offline. Second quarter of basketball, just over a minute and a half played. Here's Eklund. Here's the pass to Perkins. Down low. Here's Bagley. And he jams it with authority. Oh, just solid on the one-handed slam. And guys, when it's a tight ball game like this, he's the guy they want with the ball. Somebody you can count on. He is an extremely reliable finisher. Quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. Here's Bradshaw and the rejection by Perkins. Fast break, here they come. Herder, and it falls over the rim and in. Being an outstanding 53% for the game. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. The number's in their favor. Here's Eklund. Jabari Parker comes up with the rebound. Stepped in the line, out of bounds there, and that will cost them the possession. Both teams will make substitutions. Gone three of their first five shots to drop here in the second quarter. Perkins against Allen. And it's blocked. They get it back. Down low. Hey, you know, Kevin, that's what you want to see. Strong passing inside, leading to the hoop. Each trip down becoming more important. And you need to string some successful offensive possessions together and play tough deep. Perkins with the bucket. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row turn up, turn from up. the paint. And on the flip side, Greg, the defenders have to show more fight on the interior. They've got to offer more resistance here. And not surprising, obviously unhappy with the lack of response from his team. Can't blame him. I mean, the effort hasn't been there. Just has not been there. Hopefully, he can get the fire lit. Here in the second quarter, just under three and a half minutes played. Henry kicks to Allen. It's a 
Off the run. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. If you're going in amongst the threes, you have got to be aggressive. Boy, like his intensity, Greg. He's not afraid to take it straight to the rack on the bigger defender. Right at it. That free throw good from Allen. And here in the second quarter of action, as we approach four minutes played, Ross passes to Frank. Under to Kumbo against Grant. Takes the 13-footer. It's Autobio with the rebound. Gone one of three to start out the second quarter. And the basket by Webster. Webster's got his second bucket of the night. Oh, how pretty was that? Use the rim to protect the ball perfectly. Here's Hansa Takumbo. Poke loose. And, you know, I have no idea how he missed that one. When there's no defense around, he's usually automatic from there. Here's Dudley. Adebayo kicks to Dudley. Grant, and he folks in for the easy two. Credit the assist on that one. And, guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Loss against Allen. Puts it up from 12. No good from Ross. Gone three of their first five shots to drop here in the second quarter. The drive by Allen. The shot goes down and gets this game back to even. Allen's got five points now in the quarter. How about that move? Is this guy special or what? Just love watching him operate inside. Ross against Allen. Pass to Villa. A minute 42 left in the first half. Just five to shoot. 18 feet out. It's deflected, but he stays with it. And they'll turn it over. Could not get off a shot. 24 second violation. gone four of six from the field here in the second their offense has been great here yeah the ball movement has been terrific and they kept the defense off balance plays it up and banks it in Andre de has got his second basket of the game like that creativity down in the paint Andre de Kumpo showing you how crafty he can be scoring from there and so now a timeout taken by Mike D'Antoni So it's the visitors now. Allen kicks to Webster. Let's it go with a three. Anasanta Takumbo grabs the miss. Something that's kept this game close is the fact that the rebound stats for both teams are almost identical. The battle to a standstill on the boards has really been something to watch. And the game's not over yet. We'll see if one of these teams maintains more energy than the other going down the stretch. Here's Webster. Lost contact on the shot, and now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. And now you see them starting to really work the ball inside. This is his second trip to the free throw line. Now 
and the free throw is good. Now leading by one. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Now here's Ross. Defense is right there. Dudley against out of the Kumbo. He made that one. Basket number three for him. He's also missed two. Well, I love how fast Antetokounmpo gets to the basket. One of the most mobile guys in the game. Here's Williamson. He's guarded by Ross. Kicks it to Doug. And that's it for the first half of action. What's been a very close game here. The home team up by one. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. Keep it right here on 2K Sports. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello again. Welcome to our postseason halftime show. Ernie Johnson along with the Diesel and the Jet. Taking a look at this home squad, they've hung tough in what was a closely contested first half. If what we've seen in game one so far is any indication we're gonna have quite a series on our hands how about you Kenny what did you think about this home team well there was one pleasant surprise and that was the bench they gave them a big lift those guys came into the game they did all the dirty work and they scored baskets and Shaq let's get your input on the visiting team aggressive I called them up earlier I like it they're taking it hard to the rack dictating the pace setting the physical tone you're not going to get that by launching threes all night. Everybody knows that. That about wraps it up. Time now for the second half of the game. We go to Kevin Harlan for the call. Welcome back as we get set to continue our coverage of this round one playoff matchup. In 52% from the floor. Nice work so far from there. On to Jacumba, out there with Bagley. And it's Frank in at the center position. That's the five to begin the second half for Larry Drew. Dudley's shot is good. Dudley's got six points. And not even three quarters out of the way. So many lead changes. The fans, guys, are getting their money's worth. Heck, I should have paid to watch this one. It's been a nail. Now here's Ross. And the bucket is good. Three-point play chance here for him. He has created some terrific opportunities for himself and really made the most of it. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. Free throw good from Ross. Now Dudley. This is it to Webster. This is to Allen. Pass to Webster. Back to Allen. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. He made the only free throw attempt he had earlier in the game. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Free throw. Good. Allen. Both good from the line that time. About one minute played here in the second half. Ross finds Antetokounmpo. Ross against Devin. The pass to Antetokounmpo. Over Webster. Antetokounmpo, no good. 
Man, right play, wrong result on that one. Generally, you knock those down. Not much else you can do there. I mean, that's what you want. Too bad they weren't able to finish it off. And you can see him give a little nod and then just burst to the rim for the alley-oop slam. A pair of teammates, Greg, with a terrific feel for each other. And I tell you what, guys, that's a big play to make in a close game. Potential momentum builder there. Now here's Ross. Nine points in the game so far. And yes, it's good. Ross has got 11. And, you know, it's obvious he's a talented scorer. I mean, that's a given. A guy you can depend on to get it done in a lot of ways. Allen kicks to Adebayo. Pass to Dudley. Now here's Webster. Passes to Adebayo. Out left of the wing. Shot clock at six. Here's Grant. And a miss there on the triple. Yeah, not a great shot there, especially when you got a lockdown defender guarding him. Agreed. I mean, when the defense is right there, you've got to move the ball, make the extra pass. That's a case of a poor shot selection. Now here's Webster. Under the Kumbo defending. Allen against Ross. Allen right side over Ross. Allen shot is off. I thought he had the space to shoot comfortably there and disappointed that he missed it. Villa. He's guarded by Dudley. Here's Frank. And terrific work on the offensive glass when he picks up two. He's got six. Great effort. Terrific instincts. That's just solid all-around play, Kevin. And so now a timeout taken by Mike D'Antoni. On two or four here to start the second eight. Here's Williamson. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring hit from him. Third quarter action and just under three and a half minutes have gone. Got a piece of it. And stolen by Perkins. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact. And he'll go to the line for two. And he makes the first. Both teams will make substitutions. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Here's Williamson. Just over three and a half minutes through the third quarter of play now. Out to Parker. Lays it up off the glass. Boy, Parker is a genius in these pick and roll plays. Just knows when to cut and when to pop out for the easy shot. He rolls or pops effectively.
and the home team has possession. And there's the pass to Slater. To the paint, here's Perkins, and it's slammed in by Perkins. And guys, right now, the defense mentally not there. Can't afford too many of those in a close game like this. Yeah, G.A., you're right. Almost a free run for him there. Momentum can swing on plays like that, Kevin, especially when the finish has that much thunder. To the inside, and it's blocked. And it goes out of bounds. That one's off Parker. And so here's the home team. Four-point game. And you can see there the defender gets caught up on the pick. I think he's got to be more aggressive, stronger, getting through those screens. Can't allow shooters that kind of space to pull the trick. Mr. Williamson knocked away. And so out of bounds it goes. And they'll keep possession. to Bradshaw. Jacks up a three. Perkins pulls it in. Going to even 5 of 10 on shot attempts in the third. Sinks the three-pointer. You know, sometimes you don't like to see guys pull up from three-point range on the break, but for him, with nobody on him, that's a pretty good shot. Passes it to Bradshaw. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. Uh, okay, we got a nice little back and forth going here. Yeah, and I like it. I love seeing that. It's a lot of fun when that happens. These teams are going at each other from the outside. Slater covered by Parker. Here's Eklund. Count the bucket coming off a perfectly placed assist. Textbook. Nice pass. Great catch. Even better finish. One ten left in the third. Here's Williamson. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Kicks it to Park. And the layup falls. And I like his muscular body. This guy is able to body up defenders and still get the shot that he wants. He's excellent at finishing through contact. 43 seconds left in the third quarter. And it's Bagley at the elbow. Here's Eklund. That one goes in. The second he got around the pick and shook his man, it was straight to the bucket for the easy dupe. Very, very well done. 23 seconds left in the third quarter. The pass to Bradshaw. The shot missing gone 8 or 13 on shot attempts to begin the second half to the middle not loose it's three on three on the fast break hangs and it's good on the way 13 points in the game that's exactly how you set the table great time there. and as we end the third quarter a double digit deficit will make it tough to come back the home team up by 10 and we're just moments away from the start of the fourth quarter. Stay with us. Let's hear what Mike D'Antoni was going over with his team moments ago. Rebound, the loose ball. We gotta get him. We gotta get him. Let's go, let's go. Another one, one bit more. Greg, you can tell by his voice, he wants his guys to give everything they've got right now. No doubt, especially on the backboard. For them to secure this win, that needs to happen. Welcome back as we get set to continue our coverage of this round one playoff matchup. We've got Allen, and it's Webster in at the three spot. Throws it down despite the man right in his face. A chance here for a three-point play. And if that doesn't get them fired up, guys, nothing will. Greg, just what the doctor ordered us, some high-flying annex to narrow the deficit. Tell you what, fellas, that could give them the energy boost they've been looking for. One shot, gentlemen. And 
And so here's the home team. They've led by as much as 10. Now here's Ross. He's covered closely. He dishes it to Hatsutakumbo. Yep, that one goes. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now. Especially on the interior. Yeah, and that's four straight field goals now, Greg. They've allowed from point blank range. Can't happen. And it's going to be out of bounds. And they'll keep possession. Ross with the steal. And now it's Ross running. He can go all the way. Ross contact on the shot. And now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. Well, uh, this is what he likes to do. Try to break your spirit. I think he's trying to put this one away, quite honestly. I mean, it feels like he can lay it up against any type of defense. And he can. Impeccable from the line since halftime. No misses yet. You can't do much better than that, guys. Loss against Dudley. Shoots from the elbow. And it's off the back rim. No good. And as he squares up for mid-range, the defender right in his face. Yeah, I like the fact, Greg, that he crowded the shooter there. Made him uncomfortable. Got into his airspace a bit. Looked like he forced the shot. throw no good for out of the Kumbo thing has been outstanding in this game at 58% Webb's that one is good he's only missed one shot of his six taken on the floor Kevin it certainly hasn't been for lack of effort but still his team needs him to do more out there outside out of the Kumbo there's the lob and the Kumbo hammers the end of the and out of the Kumbo is so long I mean he stretches forever covers a ton of ground and really, whether you're up or down, it's a game of adjustments. Always. And having a good coach is critically important. I mean, you need somebody you can count on to make the right adjustment. Catch up with our sideline reporter, David Alden. Kevin, I was able to listen in on what Mike D'Antoni was talking about with his team. He got on him. He said he's got to see more intensity. He said we've put ourselves in this hole, and we've got to work our way out of it. Tell me you've got what it takes. Guys. Here's Slater, and it's good off the back of the rim and in. Yeah, a big part of this run here has been their ability to score from mid-range. Gone two or three from the field to get the fourth quarter start. Loose. Pass to Dudley. Pass to Webster. Beyond the arc. That's a miss. It's miss number two and shots from the floor. Passes to Villa. Back to Kumbo. And yes, it's good. kumbo has got eight here in the quarter. That's their third straight make off an assist. Now on against Ross. Here's Dudley. And good. 
as it just snugs right down through the net. You know, even though he's been on, they still are behind. I mean, there's only so much he can do. There's the lob at the combo. Takes the alley pass and dunks it down. And that pattern continues, guys. Another heat check. Another lob on the fire. Well, they're scorching right now. I mean, the defense has to be concerned. Nothing they're doing is stopping this run. Dudley dishes to Allen. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. First one falls for us. He's off on the second. Gone seven of seven from the field to start the final quarter. What an amazing start. And we're about three and a half minutes into the fourth quarter. And here is Dudley. He kicks to Webster. The pass to Autobio. Allen against Ross. The three from Dudley. I think Kumbo grabs the miss. And that's the battle they haven't been winning today. Their work on the glass has been porous, and that's got to change. Yeah, no question about it. I mean, as they're looking to battle back, that's one of the key elements. You got to rebound. Now here's Dudley. He's tightly guarded. Allen shot is off. The shot's there for him, and he's got to take it. I don't care if he doesn't convert. That's a shot he has to continue to take. Now here's Ross. Over to the left wing. And it's out of the Kumbo, top of the key. Out left of the wing. Here's Fia. And a great assist by out of the Kumbo as that one goes in. And that's what you give up when you don't fight over the screen. Yeah, I agree with you wholeheartedly. I mean, not a lot of effort put forth on defense there. I mean, I think he's definitely got to play up on him more and off the screen in that situation. You look at Enetokounmpo really making a difference here. And, Kevin, they need this timeout. He's flat out owning them right now. Can't miss. game, Giannis Antetokounmpo. And he's just been crushing it from the field tonight, Kevin. Whether it's been on open looks or with the guy draped all over him, he just hadn't missed much. With his percentage in the sky-high range, they've had no choice but to make him their number one option on every trip. And he'll head into the second round with his confidence at its highest level. He couldn't have picked a better time to take his game up a notch. Dudley with it. Now guarded by out of the Kumbo. Dudley's shot is good. Absolutely fearless. I mean, a, a nice subtle adjustment there going up against Quinn. I could not say it any better. Showing you some real focus taking it inside against the bigger man. Now here's under the Kumbo. Ross on the wing. One fifty-two left to play here in the fourth. Six on the shot clock. Here's Antetokounmpo. Count that one. 
Adetokounmpo has got 12 points here in the second half. Just terrific determination. First, compiling the lead and now building on it. And that's what you want to do. I mean, you can't let the opposition off the hook here. I mean, you've got to keep adding to that lead. Astavia, Ross on the wing. Ande Dekumbo looking over the floor. Tipped away. Allen against Ross. Back to Allen. Lays it up and banks it in. Boy, I like seeing the ball get to that spot. It doesn't get much better than that. They have been really controlling this one. You never want to be complacent on the floor. That's when you lose momentum. Shoots from 14. Up again. Great positioning on the putback. And giving the fans what they came to see. A, a spirited performance. Well, they've got to be pleased with the effort they've seen so far tonight. Everybody pitching in for what looks to be a solid W. Now here's Dudley. It's not going to go for him. Oh, great effort there. That's how you defend the paint. Exactly. Can't play it any better than that, Greg. It's nine seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. Out of Kumbo, kicks to Bagley. Out of Kumbo, up top. Pass to Ross, five to shoot. From downtown. And they're gonna move on to the conference semifinals. And you gotta feel good about getting each and every game here in the postseason. You know, Kevin, each game is, is just so significant and, and magnified. This has got to feel really good. Well, that'll do it for now. And you can join us during this first round of the Eastern Conference playoffs. For Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. See you later.